So should I introduce myself? Knot Boost is Surly's solution that we're featuring on a handful of frames this year. It allows you to put a variety of hub spacings into your new Surly frame. I'm going to run through removing and installing a wheel on our new Karate Monkey featuring Knot Boost spacing. Um, take a regular 5mm Allen wrench, loosen the bolt up here. Um, there's two options for wheel removal. You can just pull the wheel straight out the back or you can take the bolt all the way off, like so. Remove your axle from the system, and then the wheel will just drop out the bottom. Okay, we're gonna go through the math of not boost spacing. Here we have an illustration of the back end of, say, a Karate Monkey frame featuring our 145 millimeter spaced knot boost back end. The frame is spaced at 145 millimeters between the dropouts, which is conveniently between 142 millimeters, which is normal through axle hub spacing, and 148 millimeters, which is boosts through axle hub spacing. What happens is the frame flexes a little bit depending on which size wheel is put into the frame. How much flex? Well, let's figure that out. Say we're taking a 148 millimeter space hub and we're gonna put it into our 145 millimeter not boost space karate monkey frame. That gives us three millimeters of flex that happens in the back end of the frame. Now, that's both sides of the frame. So each side of itself Flex is a much smaller amount. Again, how much? Now we're gonna do some long division here, folks, and it's gonna get pretty complex pretty quick, but tag along and we'll have fun. So three divided by two each side of the frame. Three goes into two once. Carry that zero down. Two goes into 10 five times. One point five millimeters. That's how much each side of the frame is flexing, which is really not a whole lot. Um, hopefully, this has put all your concerns to rest. Thanks. So, what's featured on the wheels here are these little washers here and here. And what they do is they take the standard one thirty-five spaced QR hub, they space it out to one forty-two, and then they increase the axle diameter here to 12 millimeter. 